How's it going my people? How's it going Forex traders? Now guys, today in this video, I want to discuss what it takes to become a successful, a very, very hyper successful Forex trader in this industry. Now guys, at the end of the day, that's the plan. Like we came into this game, you know, whether we came from a seminar or we came from a YouTube video we watched or an ad we saw, we came into this game called Forex. And the end goal has always been to become a successful full-time Forex trader. So those guys who are working, you've got nine to five, you're just doing it, you know, but you know, your eye is in Forex. You want to, at the end of the day, quit your job because this is the dream. Let's be honest. This is the dream. We want to be able to, you know, have the luxury of our own time. We want to be able to do things when we want. We want to, everybody wants to become their own boss. And that's fine. That's perfect. But if you're going to do this, let's go about doing it the right way. Now, I decided to put, to, put together this video because... I did some digging and I found out that, guys, the success rate of people who are wanting to become full-time Forex traders isn't that much. And for somebody who trades Forex full-time, um, I think it is my responsibility and my duty to weigh in on this subject and help clarify and help you guys out, you know, to declutter all the noise so that you can actually know exactly what you should be focused on so that you can ultimately become this full-time Forex trader that you want to be and make a lot of money for yourselves. Now, for those guys who do not know me, my name is Dapper Willis. I've been doing this for 12 years. I can state categorically without any iota of doubt that I've seen it all in this game. 12 years is not a joke. I started trading at the age of 17. Yes, I might look very young, but I started trading at the age of 17 and I just turned 29 about 11 days ago. So yeah, happy birthday to me, right? And I've went, trust me when I say I've seen it all. And as, you know, like I say, God will have it. I have gone on to become very, very successful as it stands. I manage well over 150 million US dollars. Asset. I've got $150 million asset under management as we speak. I manage funds for some of the most wealthiest people in the Middle East, right? So I am the I am the benchmark for Forex success in the industry. I mean, it doesn't get any better than this. And I hope that by the time I'm done with this video, you guys would actually go ahead to surpass me, surpass all my records, ask about that. Paul Willis, they'll tell you. Now, guys, like I was saying earlier, Put it together this video i don't want you guys to go anywhere if indeed you want to be the guy who is redrawing and not always depositing because most people are always depositing into the trading account i want you guys to be the ones that are redrawing i want you guys to you know by the time I'm, by the time you guys are done watching this video i want you guys to take all the lessons you take from this and actually use it implement it so that you can be the one redrawing you know redrawing money and not depositing you know no more deposits we're only talking about redraws. All right, guys, all you need to do is sit right there. Don't go anywhere. Ensure you watch this video till the very end. Let me help you guys put together the framework of what it takes to become a successful full-time Forex trader. All right, guys, don't go anywhere and let's jump into the video. Let's go. All right, guys, so welcome back inside my screen. I love you guys very much. Now, the way I like to do my videos, I like to speak from my heart. No script, no nothing. I need no script. <laughs> I need no thing to tell you the how exactly the journey goes. Why? Because I've been on that journey. I've been low and I've been high. I've been at the middle point and I've been at the brink of literally saying I'm not doing it again. <laughs> I'm not doing this thing again. And I've been at that point whereby I'm walking into a room and everybody's clapping for me and they're telling me you're the best. I've had my lows and my highs, right? And like I said, I'm in the best position to tell you exactly how to go about this. But before I do any of that, I want to encourage all you beautiful people out there to smash the subscribe button right there. Just give it a little tickle because why not? It's for your own benefit. If you know indeed you want to be able to watch in, you want to be able to be watching videos like this once they come out from your street that world is all you need to do is smash that subscribe button so that you don't get left out. What I like to do on my channel is I like to speak the truth about Forex trading. So guys, let's jump into this. Assuming you have subscribed. 
The very first thing, and I'm going to use my own personal story and try and use that as a lesson to you guys so that you guys understand. So when I came into the game, you know, obviously everybody wants to be as me, me too. Like I was 17, I want to... I want to make money, man. You know, I, this is what I want to do. You're trying to tell me that with the computer and so I just click buttons and I can be, I can become rich. Why not? Sign me up. Hold on. I said, sign me up for this forex thing. Quickly, quickly signed up for a broker. You know, deposited money and like I tell, keep telling you guys. You see these brokers, man, they want you, they want you to bring the bread. <laughs> Obviously, as you put the money in, they start calling you, Ah, Mr. Willis, yeah, 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 we can make you, you know, don't worry. You're... In fact, some brokers even go as offering free uh, seminars and education, which you shouldn't take. Now, I know a lot of you guys came into the game from broker seminars and all that, but you realize, as you spend more time in the game, you realize that they didn't really teach you anything. Anyways, that's by the way, so I put my money in, you know, I'm happy, clicking button, bam, bam, bam. You know how the story goes, blown account. I spent the first, so I've been doing trading for 12 years now, right? I spent the first three and a half years trying to get my life together in this game, right? I, it took me three and a half years for me to kind of like get on my feet. Now, um, don't worry guys, I'm gonna recommend the best resource so that it doesn't have to take you three and a half years. I'll recommend the best training program to com compress that time, okay? Like I said in this video, I want to show you guys, talk about strategy, I want to talk about everything, capital, everything that is required for you guys to become a successful full-time trader. However, back to what I was saying, right? First three and a half years, I don't have access to, you know, the best education. I don't really know much that's going on. Get into the game, bam, blown account. And so it's at this point that you start looking for, you know, trading strategies and blah, blah, blah. I want to highlight something here. You see, what actually helped me, what saved the day in my trading career, right? It was one, two things actually, but I'll start with the first one. It was a change in my mindset, okay? How I perceived Forex. Guys, listen, please. Let me adjust my mic. How I perceive Forex. You see, before my, my days of profit, consistent profitability started, I was like most of the kids that you see on social media. I see a lot of videos on social media whereby people are gathered in a room, they got their phones, and they're trying to Obviously, they're excited. They're, they, they, they think they're flipping accounts. They're excited and all that. So that used to be me. But the thing that nobody tells you is what is posted on social media is only when they are, they are able to successfully flip the account. Nobody talks about when they don't flip the account. And I can tell you for free, okay, that uh, nobody flips accounts more than three, four, at best, four times. Three, four times. Now, the reason why this happens is because, you see, the market is a game of probabilities. There's only so many times you can win. Now, because of the fact that they're throwing caution to the wind when it comes to flipping these accounts, they're not taking into consideration risk management. Yes, you get lucky. It's called beginner's luck. But after some time, it doesn't take that long before that account is gone. And once the account is gone, then reality sets in. And once reality sets in, it really starts to play with your mental space. Now you're afraid. You go from you want your money back and then you lose everything and now you're afraid and then you start jumping from strategy to strategy and oh my guys, you know the entire story. It was one guy, it was a fund manager in London, I was fortunate enough to meet the guy. He pretty much told me and explained to me, he said, yo, look Dabs, this is not how the game goes. You want to do this thing full time, you need to understand the game and be able to play the game in order to beat the game at its own game. Trading is meant to grow capital, not to flip capital. I take that again. I know some of you guys who are watching this have smaller trading accounts, but we'll talk about that later. But first, you need to understand, I am here to grow capital. So you have this at the back of your mind. You're like, okay, to grow capital, that means, but then my capital is small. How am I going to go about that? 
We discuss that later. Grow capital. I'm here, whatever it is, I'm not here to flip the money. I'm here to patiently wait for the market to line up with my trading opportunities and grow my capital, okay? And another thing that you guys need to understand that really changed my trading is that less is more, meaning that you should look for quality, quality trades over the crazy amounts of course guys think about it there are so many trading opportunities out there if you're just going around clicking buttons shooting here and there guys the, what is your edge you have no edge you can't be trading to have i see people have eight trades open at the same time that used to be me not anymore okay and that's exactly how i was able to transition from being the guy who was just playing around with the game to a man who had strategy to a man who had a plan okay so the very first thing that you want to get into your head is you need to understand that you are here to grow capital i will explain how you can get the capital towards the end of the video listen we're here to what to grow capital we're not here i'm begging you guys we're not here to flip accounts forget about what these people are showing you on social media they are only trying to feed their own bank accounts brokers encourage you to flip accounts because that's how they make money they make money in two ways they make money from blown accounts and they make money from commission nobody will tell you this only i because I don't really care about the brokers. <laughs> because the brokers, when I started trading, they didn't care about me too. They just used to take all my money. So now that I know the truth, I'm here to liberate all my beautiful people. So the very first thing, as you embark on your journey to becoming a full-time trader, because guys, if think about it, if your life, guys, you, you want to raise your family with this thing called Forex, right? That's the plan. You want to raise your family. You want to, you want your entire ability to eat, it's going to depend on this thing called Forex, correct? Good. So I'm just trying to check how many minutes I've gone into the video just so that I'm not boring you guys. But guys, I can go on and on about this first, but understand that, guys, we're here to grow capital. Now, over to the second thing that really, really changed my trading was my approach to Forex in terms of my strategy. Now, I know a lot of people struggle, and a lot of people struggle when it comes to strategy and how to come in and out of trading and all that. What I did was, after playing around so many years, playing with different indicators and all that, I was able to understand. I was able, like I said to you guys, I'll share with you guys my exact strategy. It's very straightforward. I was able to understand the game properly when it came to trading strategies. I realized, I'm like, yo, listen, I noticed that people who trade on lower time frames and who are always in and out of the game, they don't really make money. So these big boys, how, how exactly are they going about, how exactly are they going about making money? Then I started to realize that they do what they call a top-down analysis, meaning that, and this is exactly how I trade, and I teach this. So Forex Mastery students, you guys are not new to this, but the Forex Mastery students, please, I'm going to need to share some of the secret information that we have. Don't be upset, but we need to educate people. We need to liberate them, right? See, this is what you do when it comes to strategy. What you need to understand is the direction of the market. And the idea is to go on higher time frames, identify what direction this market is going in, okay? then scale to a lower time frame and trade in that direction. This way, you are trading against friction. Rather, this is the rest. I'll take that again. This way, you are trading in the direction of less friction. Think about it. It's like a river is flowing. Why am I going to want to swim in that river? And that's what lower time frames and all these strategies and what everybody is teaching you how to do does. Because you don't really see the bigger picture. As if, listen guys, you know you want to raise your family with trading. You know you want to retire with trading. You know you want this to be your thing. Open your ears. Open it like this. Use the top-down approach. Because with this one, you can trade any market. With this one, you stress-free. How does it work once again? 
you want to now for those of you guys who want to learn how to do this the top down analysis properly the link to the forex so i teach it on the forex mastery program the link is in the description as always or around here ensure to get it but let me give you a little sneak peek into what is actually inside the program so that you guys understand that with this one your life has changed understand this you want to go on higher time frames you want to see the overall flow of the market Monthly will tell so you step monthly will show you the overall flow. We don't trade on high time frames, we use it just to see what's happening. Monthly will show you weekly is where we come to plot the key levels. All those key levels that people are using indicators to plot and no 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 you don't need any indicators. Use your the, the the Forex Mastery program will train your eyes to look to spot and identify supply and demand zones. First of all, you know the direction. Secondly, you know the supply and demand zone. Last but not the least, you come down to a four-hour time frame and you look for trading opportunities that are in line with what the overall trend is doing or saying. And you're pretty much good to go. So what you can actually do is, and this is why I like this approach because if you do your analysis on a higher time frame, chances are that the projection is going to be like, 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 pips. Like you can literally project up to 2,000 pips into the future. And then when you scale to a lower time frame, all you need to do is trade in that direction with a smaller stop loss. This way you're literally using a 50 pip stop loss to bag 500, 600 pips. That takes me back to my first point. We're using a small, this amount, the risk is this small to catch this big, this? <laughs> I hear that all the time on Instagram. This, this big, okay? Because we're here to grow capital. We want to, we want to take our time. Look at the, this pair. My favorite pairs are USD based pairs. Uh, um, GBP USD, Euro USD, AUD USD. I, I take a good look at them, right? And I'm like, okay, this pair is about to trade one thousand pips. So I go into this pair, okay, and I say, okay, I'm going to wait for the, everything to line up, blah, blah, blah. And then I patiently wait as the market is about to start trending on a higher time frame. I scale to a lower time frame and I jump in with a small stop loss and I stay there and I catch the entire move. And don't forget, even within that entire big 1,000 pip move, the market will still retrace whereby you can even see another opportunity to jump in again. You see how we're just taking, if we have $10,000, we just risk maybe $500 or $1,000. So we're literally risking $700 in this case to bring back home $4,000 or $3,000. We're here to grow capital. And with this approach, because of the amount of time it takes for your trade to hit, take profit, you can enter the trade, close your laptop and go and relax. Go and chill. This way you're not emotionally attached to the market. Okay, and you can see things a lot more clearly. Please, I'm begging you guys. This is, uh, I know, like, the, I put together the Forex Mastery program and the top down analysis, and I know this is my thing, but I'm urging you guys this is the most realistic approach, and I'll keep talking about it in all my videos. Get, get acquainted with the top down analysis so that you don't be swayed by all these people trying you today you double their money tomorrow is gone this way your cost system guys the future of your family is going to depend on your ability to trade forex if you want to become a full-time forex trader do you really think that flipping accounts is sustainable is not join the league of the big boys that grow accounts go and ask all your investment experts what ask them this way of flipping account or this way of growing account which one is reasonable and which one is sustainable and they will tell you the truth now and this takes me to my last point which is and guys stumbled on top-down analysis my literally that strategy changed my life that's the reason why everybody loves me I, very wealthy investors they love me because my approach is very calm relaxed small small risk to make a lot of money right you want to adopt this as well once again the link to the forex mastery program in the description or around here somewhere and now let's head over to the next thing which you're going to really need when it comes to becoming a full-time forex trader which is capital now you see the capital is quite a gray area it's straightforward but then it's a gray area now for me <clears throat> i've been seeing a lot of uh, don't get me wrong i've been seeing a lot of prop firms out there in fact as much as a matter of fact i'm going to do an entire video on prop firms 
Um, I'm going to do an entire video on prop firms, but that's for another day. Nowadays, a lot of people are very aware. Sorry, guys. Nowadays, a lot of people are very aware about um, trading and investing and stuff like that. You have to understand, people are lazy. <laughs> people are lazy. So there's a lot of money. When I, I, had an, I had an event where I was saying there's money everywhere. There's money everywhere. You might see even your mom. You understand what I'm saying? The moment you tell her, ah, mom, my trading is starting to pick up. My, my trading is starting to, like, I'm starting to make you like, really? Let me see. Like, how much do you make? Like, oh, I took this $1,000 account. I was able to grow it by 50%, 60%. She'll be like, so you mean you had 1000 and now it's 1500 ah, So, you know, she start making phone calls. Mm, I have won $20,000 somewhere. Guys, that's exactly how the game goes. When it comes to capital, you have nothing to worry about. But the issue why a lot of people cannot really trigger this capital clause or rather convince investors to give them capital is because they are not sure. They are not sure of themselves when it comes to their strategy and approach to forex trading. They're not sure. And because of this, they are afraid to seek. And that's exactly why they run towards prop firms. Because, you see, prop firms, prop firms, the risk is minimal. You pay a little amount, maybe $100, and then you can act. You try to access a big amount. And another thing about prop firm, guys, the percentage of people who pass prop firm challenges is about 3%. Not a lot of people are getting funded by prop firms. Prop firms are just here to make a lot of money. Now, as a full-time trader, how do you say, okay, Mr. Willis has said you cannot, you cannot use prop firms, you can't double your accounts. How can we do it? Good. Get your strategy right. Get your mentality right. How much money do I want to make in six months? How much money do I want to make in one year? In six months, I want to be able to return 30%. At the end of the year, I want to be, to be able to return 60%. That's fine. So you need to calculate, okay, out of this 60%, how much money do I want to make in terms of cash? Okay, this year I want to make $30,000. Or this year I want to make $60,000. So now, what that means is you need a $100,000 trading account for you to be able to do this. Now, the reason why I say 60% is 60% is very, very realistic. Think about it. You're the kid who is always flipping accounts, right? So, flipping accounts in two weeks, three weeks. So, to do 60% over 12 months should not be a problem, right? Think about it. You're relaxed. Now you're actually relaxed. There's no pressure. Guys, what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to remove the pressure because it's the pressure that makes traders crack. You will crack under this pressure that is being mounted on social media. You will crack under the pressure of your small trading accounts. You need to be able to access a significant amount of capital. I want to make $60,000 this year, so I need $100,000 in my trading account. How do you go about this? It's simple. Grow your own small trading account to wherever it is and speak to people about your ability to trade. You can raise a hundred thousand dollars easier than you think, or better still, if you're able to grow your account over fifty percent, a live account. Okay, let's put together a challenge. I've got a one thousand dollar account. If you go one thousand dollar account, grow it from one thousand dollars to one thousand five hundred dollars over a period of four months, and then reach out to the support team on the Forex Mastery program, and we'll fund you. I feel a lot safer funding traders who have grown their account over a period of time than traders who flip their accounts. Because people who took their accounts up like this are going to send it right back down. Your primary focus shouldn't really even be on capital. Get your trading right. The money will come. The money is everywhere. I'm telling you, forget about these proprietary firms. You go out there and investors will throw money at you. $1,000 account, grow it to $1,500 over five months. You're a superstar. But if you take a $1,000 account and take it to $7,000, 
when you go and see an investor, they'll say, mm, you took it to 7K. You'll notice that there's only the investors that don't that don't really have that much money that will invest with, with you. People that have two, three hundred thousand dollars will be like, no, this is something is off here. Do you get what I'm saying? Like something is off. Like I I don't think I can invest with you because your your returns are too high. <laughs> your returns are too high. Like you mean you did so what what that translates to is if your returns are this high, that means your risk is this high as well. Focus on growing that small trading account, and this is exactly how you can now start accessing significant amounts of capital. The reason why big time investors, guys, my biggest investor when they, they went, I invested fifty million dollars with me. I remember when we, when I had the meeting with them, I showed them two funds. One fund had sixteen point eight percent return on investment. The other fund was more aggressive. When I mean fund, I'm talking about managed accounts because we were already managing funds before the biggest investor came on board. So I showed them showed them the one of uh, the the I showed them the the, the the high the more aggressive fund. I think we had we were up like maybe forty five percent at the time, and I almost lost the deal. Like your returns are fantastic, but we're, we're a bit concerned. I'm like, okay, this is a more aggressive fund, but I've got a 16% annual return fund of, uh, I've got a, an annual return fund of 16.1%. This is less aggressive. What do you guys think about this? They invest, you won't believe that they invested in the one of 16%. Said, this is the one we want. You want to be able to access, because as a full time trader, prop, you can, you, prop firms are not. Prop firms are not reliable over a long period of time. You cannot base your life off of prop firms. So what if they say you log in one day and you, can, you cannot trade the accounts? What happens? You want a very concrete deal with a concrete individual or a concrete organization that puts money in a trading, their trading account and they give you access and then you trade it, you manage it. This way you know, I'm relaxed. I've told these people 50% for the whole year. Do you know what 50% of the whole year is? That means all you need to do is make 5% a month. One trade. One trade. And I'm telling you that with the top-down analysis, what you learned from the Forex Mastery program, guys, one trade, you can... You, like I was explaining to you guys, 2,000 pips. Do you know what 2,000 pips is? With 2,000 pips and a small distance, you place one trade, one trade in a whole year, you make that 50 pips, 50, 60. Imagine you trade only once and you've hit your target for the whole year and you still kept your risk low. Guys, don't play with me, man. I'm trying to open everybody's mind to this, this, this approach to trading, but I don't know, man. That Paul Willis is working, but these clowns on social media are working harder. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm working hard, but these clowns on these clowns on social media posting cars and deceiving people are literally working harder because I'm trying, I'm begging to explain to you guys how it's supposed to go. If not, you end up throwing all your money away and you quit the game. You want to be a full-time trader, you want this thing to work for you, go down this route. Get your education right, get the Forex Mastery Program, the link is in the description as always. Get it, study it, put it in your brain, understand it, digest it, feel it. Feel it. Trade, grow that account from 1K to 1.5 and then start looking for investors. Better still, come to us. Will give you an investor provided you've grown that account over a period of time. This way you are relaxed and you're less prone to blowing the account. So, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that's my time. That's my mini story. Um, once I understood these three things, trading is for trading is for growing accounts, not flipping accounts, understanding the best approach, whereby I, I risk this little to make this much. You know, I'm like, okay, cool. You know, I'm going to grow my account with this strategy. I'm like, next thing is to look for capital. I'm like, okay, investors don't really want crazy returns, so I kept my returns. It's even better for me. I'm chilling. Kept my returns realistic. Kept my risk low. And I have it all. That's exactly how you have it all. Understand that trading is for growing capital, not flipping. Get the right strategy. And keep your risk and return 
not as low as possible, but as reasonable as possible. And that's exactly how you grow in the Forex trading industry. Once again, guys, that's my time. My name is Dapo Willis. I love you guys very much. Thank you for sticking, staying to the very end of this video. That's it. That's exactly how you become a millionaire or a billionaire Forex trader in this industry, right? I love you guys very much. If you haven't already grabbed the Forex Mastery Program, I encourage you to do so. The link is in the description as always. And I'll catch you guys in my subsequent videos. Take it easy and peace out.